Hi, I'm Andrew with Riverbed Builders. It is the 2019 Home Garden and Remodeling Show. I'm super excited to bring to you our booths, which right now, it just looks like a mess sitting on the trailer. But here in the next two days, we're gonna transform this into some beautiful water features and hopefully everything goes smoothly. big boulders this is going to be the uh, pondless waterfall here so there's gonna be water cascading all down through here and disappearing and then we're gonna have our water wall spilling here there'll be water crashing down between these big boulders it's gonna look cool Over here in this pile of junk, that is going to be our pond and another fountainscape over here. So that's going to be look awesome. We're working with advanced grounds. We got another um, fountainscape going in over there in their booth with Damon, and that's going to look awesome. So everything is coming together here uh, tomorrow. Hopefully, we'll get some of these things tied up and maybe some water running and see what happens. Day two of the home garden and remodeling show. So I'm super excited about what we got done yesterday. Um, and today we're gonna start working on the pond. So this is kind of tricky, but uh, I think we can pull it off. We are getting things done here at the home garden and remodeling show. So we got our waterfall running. We got our slate wall roughed in. We got our pond roughed in. We got our other fountainscapes were roughed in. So hopefully in the next couple hours, we can show you an actual garden space.
So, I'm very excited that it's done. I'm really happy how it turned out. Um, I hope if you're in the area, you can come and see us at the Home Garden and Remodeling Show in Louisville, Kentucky this weekend. But uh, if not, you can enjoy this video. But uh, um, we have 52 hours uh, in labor of setting this booth up from, from uh, starting loading the trailers to getting it done last night. So I'm really pleased. So I want to take you around and kind of show you what we did um, here with this feature. So it may not look like it on camera, but these boulders are enormous. So let me see if I can get a shot here. So you can see my hand. I mean, this, this rock here alone is pushing 600 pounds. Um, our machine could barely lift them to get them in here, but I think big boulders really make a waterfall look look amazing and more natural I don't know you can tell me if you think that uh, you'd rather have some small stacked up boulders or some big boulders that look more realistic like something you should see out in nature so it's really cool how we construct these um, it looks like one big rock but there's actually probably one two three four five six rocks that make up this one waterfall um, so these are actually three rocks down here that connect together and make this one beautiful waterfall but that's kind of how we want it to look we want it to look like these boulders were carved out by this water flowing over them for hundreds of years so but so this was a new product for us this year. Um, it's been on the market for about two years. But this is the first time we personally used it and I am blown away by how cool this stacked wall looks. I mean, it's simple, it's elegant, it has an awesome sound. I don't know if it's coming through on the video like it is right here, but it just sounds wonderful. I could take a nap right here on this sidewalk. But you mix that in with some big boulders over on each side and just gives it a real um, natural and uh, a look like it's been there forever so i love it i hope that we use these on every project now because i'm just in love with this and there's all kinds of different things you can do with them so and now my all-time favorite and what got me in to building water features is koi ponds so i've always loved keeping fish and uh inside, outside, uh, anywhere I could possibly keep water and fish, I would do it growing up. And uh, so I think the booth would not be complete without having a koi pond. So we've even got some fish in here for the weekend, swimming around. I don't know if you can see them. They're being a little bit shy, but uh, talk about awesome. there you have it folks the home garden and remodeling show uh, here in Louisville Kentucky we were proud to be associated with this and uh, can't wait to get out there and talk to everybody and, and see everybody and, and uh, hopefully we sell a few water features but if you like these videos please like and subscribe to our channel and uh, we'll be making more videos so 
this is the last day of the home garden remodeling show and it does not feel like spring at all here so hopefully we have a good turnout and uh, we get everything picked up and hopefully it doesn't turn into a snowstorm time to put the game face on one last day it's kind of bittersweet because uh, you only got one more day to make all the sales and hopefully we have a turnout with the snow but uh, it's gonna be nice to get to relax a little bit after it's all tore down and put away this booth is always kind of a little bit of a headache to get set up but it is such a labor of love I mean after you get done with the three days and you've talked to all these people and inspired all these backyards even the ones that you know we don't end up getting in contact with and maybe they did it themselves or you know maybe even found somebody else to do it but it's awesome to be an inspiration and uh, you know to kind of give them um, some ideas for their backyard So it is tear down time at the home show, which is very sad to see our water features go away, but hopefully we got a bunch of good leads out of it and uh, it works out. So we'll see, but uh, now the time to get all these big boulders out of here and on the truck. <laughs> 